Hi, welcome to the Professor GV show where you learn success through stories. Today I have a very very interesting personality with me. She's Chandigarh's first entrepreneur, uh, somebody who's accepted she's an entrepreneur and today the topic is going to be entrepreneurship and the story of lovely Anjum Singh. Anjum is a wife, a daughter-in-law, a daughter. So welcome Anjum to the Professor GV show. Thank you so much Gaurav for having me here. It is such a pleasure to be here. All right, so Anjum, today is all about you, your story. We would like to know Anjum's life, mein, Anjum, Anjum, kaise bani? How did Anjum, you know, become an entrepreneur and what is that journey? Anjum's story kya? Okay, so um, I belong to a very small place, Shimla. At that time it was very small. So I was born in Shimla, brought up there. And, you know, I, and I was very fond, like I was very fond of Shimla. I have a sibling, I have a younger brother. My parents, like my dad was in the life insurance corporation. Wow. My mom was also working, she was auditor general. So basically I belong to a service class family. Mm -hmm. And as you know, all parents aspire. Hmm. My father wanted to me to become a doctor. Hmm. So he said ki, you know, and my kya tha? I to jaise hospital jaati thi, I used to faint, but tha, nahi, nahi. my daughter has to become a doctor. So obviously, I said, chalo, thik hai, dad ka dream pura karne ki koshish to karni hi chahiye. Hmm. Uh, so then I I did my science, I did medicine. Matlab obviously then I did not get through that. That's then I continued to do my BSc. And then, but then you know, during this thing, I got a lot of interest. I thought I'll join the civil services. So I wanted to do in, wanted to go into Indian foreign services. Uh, just like a typical, typical. Mil, you know, yeah. middle class service ki jo story hoti hai, doctor ban jao, engineer ban jao, and like you know civil services mm. karlo, wow. Correct. Achha. So yeah. then uh, and then you know and unfortunately what happened that I talked also in my DSC. So sure. I got admission. So in, when you are you know in merit, then you don't need to appear for any entrance exam for any course. So then I got into public administration. Wow. So I started studying public administration and then we had this uh, MBA. So my dad said, oh, it doesn't matter, you give MBA ka exam. Bhi de do. So I gave MBA ka exam de di and then I got through MBA. MBA also. So many MBA B. MBA kaise kiya? Oh, maine HP University se kiya. Because Achha, my yeah, because my my focus yeah, yeah. was not to go into MBA. Yeah. Because my direction was ki chalo public administration karungi, fir civil ke liye baithungi na. Jab when you were going through KR, you want your father wanted to uh, you to become a doctor, and aap nikle nahi usme se. Us samay how did you overcome that? You know, you must be nervous. You must be having anxiety. A sense of kind of ke kya ho gaya meri life. Mein. How did you overcome that? No, so no, this is a paradox. So I was like very relieved that I did become a doctor because mujhe tha ki agar main doctor ban gayi, agar mera medicine clear ho gaya, to yar me wo hospitals aur wo, so matlab there was no problem. I knew I was very bright. Ha, ha, matlab mujhe tha ki matlab and yes, eleven, twelve, I did dissections and all that. That was fine. But you know, you have that. My passion actually was writing, which of course. So initially I had wanted to you know go join but my this thing was join the National Geographic. Why I wanted to do Indian Foreign Services also was because I wanted to travel. So my passion was basically to travel, see the world. My passion was not to become a doctor, study for eight years, <laughs> nine years, whatever. So so I was personally I was very relieved that I didn't become. Uh, obviously, I felt bad that I disappointed my dad, but then nice. I think so. Uh, story goes on. We have done MBA. We have done MBA. We have done MBA. We have done MBA. So then I did my MBA. So I was doing my MBA. Then I. Uh, you know, generally, then I went to Delhi because I, I was very fond of German. So I did a certificate course in German. I got wow. a, I was a gold medalist there. Wow. And then I thought that I will, you know, go to Delhi, Max yes. Miller, you know, just yeah. take that profession, uh, yeah. profes profession, you know, forward. Hmm. Uh, but then incidentally, I uh, got selected in the Times of India. So that was wow. a... Wow, Apna Times of India. Uh -huh. Yeah, wow. yeah. So then Delhi, okay. I just generally applied. I walked in, they said, okay, join. So hmm. Hmm. that was life. Professional life has been very, very you know, comfortable. Mm -hmm. So then I did this, then I just 
then obviously when you get into such a big media house you don't do anything else except <laughs> I'm so excited and it's like a One, great high for me at what, that what time what did you like you know uh, end times of india like you know what were you when you left times of india so when i left times of india i was a uh, deputy deputy chief manager with them and i was heading the entire implementation and operations of wow. entire north india at shaadi ka hui anju शादी मेरी हो गई थी मेरी शादी अवेंस वर्किंग तब हुई सो माय बेटर हाफ ही वाज डूइंग हिज होटल मैनेजमेंट सो ही इज अ बेसिकली होटल मैनेजमेंट नाम बता दो अभी अपने भाई का नाम यू सेड सिबलिंग छोटा भाई और अपने हस्बैंड का नाम सो माय 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 ब्रदर्स नेम इज संदीप एंड माय हस्बैंड्स नेम इज रॉबिन वेरी नाइस वेरी नाइस ओके सो आज इज अ लव मैरिज सो वो उसमें भी थोड़ा सा Who are because you know we we don't belong to the same religion. So my mm-hmm. dad did not agree for you know mm-hmm. quite a number of years, six seven years. So mm-hmm. he, he was. Yeah, Anjum like, Singh. That means Sardar Nee. Yeah, I am from Haryana, yeah, but he is a Pandit. So he is a. He is a Pandit. I am a Pandit. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, so it was like that. So then my dad did not agree for quite some time. But चलो uh-huh. ultimately then he agree. तो मैं मज़े के बाग था. हाँ. मेरी Bibi भी Sardar Nee. But I think that's the I I think that's the best uh, combination. Combination yeah, best. Yeah. बट मुझे पंडित पंडित कहती रहती है तुम भी कहती हो बिकॉज़ सी सो देयर व्हाट हैपेंस रॉबिन टोल्ड मी मैंने मतलब सो बिकॉज़ ही शर्मा ऑब्वियसली एंड आफ्टर मैरिज इट्स एक्सपेक्टेड दैट यू चेंज योर यू नो सरनेम देन देन आई सेड नो 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 एंड रॉबिन सिंह साउंड्स बेटर देन यू नो अंजुम शर्मा तो बदल लो तो बदल लो ये हुई ना ये ये तो और हमारा एक वो हुआ कि चलो ठीक है तुम अंजुम सिंह रहो मैं रॉबिन शर्मा ही रहूंगा <laughs> तो उसके बाद लाइक यू नो हाउ डिड डिड मैरिज एनीवेज इफेक्ट योर करियर यस इट डिड सो देन सो हाउ इट हैपेंस आफ्टर दैट आई डिड नॉट एक्सपेरिमेंट बिकॉज़ देन माय हस्बैंड दिस रॉबिन ही यू नो ही वाज ही ही टर्न्ड एन एंटरप्रेन्योर एंड देन ही सेड ओके ही वांटेड टू रन अ रेस्टोरेंट सो ही डिड ओपन अ रेस्टोरेंट एंड देन क्या नाम था दैट वाज द नेम बाय ओएसिस सो दैट वाज कॉल्ड द ओएसिस या so he ran it for around 4 5 years and then 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 as you know sometimes businesses don't work they went very well then of course is yeah not that easy, easy as correct. it sounded to be like you know it to, is yeah, definitely yes difficult. and then yeah. yes of course then you know then some some things happened which did not work but uh, when, not when he was failing you were the anchor of the family yeah so then right? it was you me were, you were yeah. yeah wow yeah 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 so Currently, what are you doing? Times of India. के बाद you joined uh, Thai so, yeah. Chandigarh. Yes. So then I joined uh, Thai Chandigarh, which was entirely different. Hmm. So you know, you come from a corporate world, and you know, you you like that's a different kind of a life, totally. Wow. So, like now, I want to know your journey. How did Anjum, the career woman, become an entrepreneur? You know, how did you become an entrepreneur? What was that mindset? What makes an entrepreneur? Uh, so uh, what happened was that so in obviously when you are working in a corporate you are working in a system driven organization so everything yes. is there you just going you know as per them you may know it but within the system you you know within the set processes you Absolutely you do right. you perform you do conversion whatever you do hmm. so but what it is it will be between the processes that you can do but whenever when i came here so then i realized that there was nothing it was like just up to me you know where to take it what to do it how to do it and you know generally matlab so so yeah that was a great challenge so where i had a team of almost 20 people here i was doing everything on my own definitely no which is a great learning also and then you know then slowly you know i grew my team then i realized yeah there should be some some processes we came in you know they came in then they we came in with some directions you know with so there i realized so that here i innovated you had you had freedom to yeah you know, correct build things also. build things and then you know to innovate to and the best part about tai is that whenever you present an idea it is very well taken wow so because obviously this is the you know the entire organization is about entrepreneurs of entrepreneurs and they're so open to you know uh, ideas to change to innovations and everything that it was like very heartwarming it and was as if you were running your own company yeah so that you get wow. an adrenaline rush so the more you know your your ideas accepted mm-hmm. the more they say okay yeah do this to matlab ye bolti thi so encouragement bhi aata hai ki jab aapko ek freedom milta hai kuch bhi kar then you can actually work as an entrepreneur and validation, validation. improvement Wonderful. so what when i i would give an idea they would say yeah and we can do it and better how you can better Because it you were probably thinking for the betterment of thai and that's why your ideas were accepted right correct and then i think everyone realized also you know that uh, like you know we were work together and you know and today see 
from 175 wow. we are 350 members in wow. two years amazing so amazing. and all thanks to all the members the ec governing council but yes. the thing is this ki yaar but matlab like, this was very heartwarming they were very accommodating very open to ideas very open to you know growth wonderful but ek cheez reh gayi you know as an entrepreneur and i am a serial entrepreneur i call myself a winspreneur these days but the one thing that you haven't covered and ye har ek entrepreneur ko face karna padta that is risk abhi jab when you are working for some place ye risk aapko ek pata hai salary aane ek entrepreneur ko wo salary nahi aati so entrepreneur or entrepreneur mein ye jo risk hai what was what was going on in your mind ke when you were like you know when you came out as an entrepreneur ke you're doing things for the betterment of the company you're thinking ke ye aise chalana hai as if it's your own company but usme risk ka नहीं रिस्क तो था द रिस्क इज देर टू परफॉर्म नो मे बी समी सी बिकॉज आज इज नॉट इट इज नॉट दैट आई हैव द सेम प्रेजिडेंट और यू द सेम लीडरशिप एवरी ईयर एवरी ईयर द प्रेजिडेंट एंड दीम चेंज यू हैव यू हैव टू मोल्ड योर सेल्फ टू यू नो विद एवरी प्रेजेंस थिंकिंग करेक्ट विद द वे दे वर्क एंड देन यू हैव इफ यू हैव टू गेट योर दिस थिंग डन then you have to you know perspective kisi yeah. ka koi mindset hai kisi ka koi mindset hai to understand that perspective wow. and to understand that perspective and you know to make them understand your and get get things done you know and to make make, make them realize that they actually they are doing so, so this is how so anjum how does an entrepreneur a entrepreneur kehta hai ke like you know i'll increase my sales and my grow ho jaunga how does an entrepreneur grow you know kahin na kahin you would also want ke kisi din i you know convert this entrepreneurship into entrepreneurship yes absolutely and, and your brother uh, and your husband robin he also started something in entrepreneurship and ye nahi man karta ek entrepreneurship ek preparation nahi hai entrepreneurship ke liye yeah you never know the weather rotates no no so you're right like on that almost an, a preparation ke if you can you know manage this business if you can manage this enterprise you can definitely manage something of your own yes Asani? yes absolutely and can you believe this god of initially when i came i knew nothing about you know entrepreneurship what is startup incubation centers no i have learned so much now when you know members new members join and when the way i speak or even you know when i go to universities and students speak to me and you know when i tell them you know about tai and invariably everyone asks me ki uh, aapka कौन सा स्टार्टअप है देन आई हैव टू टेल दम नो आई एम वर्किंग विथ टाइम आई एम अगेन एज यू से नॉट एन ऑन्ट्रप्रन्योर बट एन इंट्रप्रन्योर सो यू नेवर नो ऐसे ऐसे कहीं से आइडिया मिल गया और ऑन्ट्रप्रन्योर ही बन गया वॉट अ जर्नी यू नो अ जर्नी वी कैन ऑल रिलेट टू इट्स अ सिंपल स्टोरी ऑफ अ यंग गर्ल हु केम अप विद द सेम एस्पिरेशन लाइक यू नो जो पेरेंट्स की एस्पिरेशन होती हैं एंड देन शी मेड समथिंग ऑफ अर ओन वेन शी मेड समथिंग ऑफ अर ओन then she took charge usne kaha yaar sirf employee ban ke nahi reh jana hai you know mujhe aisi cheeze karni hai i want to do such things that i can bring real value to this organization so that we grow together you know and is uh, anjum i can say has transformed tai chandigarh you know and she's done that by being an entrepreneur anjum ek last cheez camera ki taraf dekho you know and in youngsters ko batao you know anybody who's listening what is it that they do need to do in life jo ki unki life thodi si badal jaye can you you know give some value to our listeners you know yeah so what i would like to say is that do what is your passion matlab you maybe you know our parents obviously they have their dreams but you have your own dreams so we should have the courage uh, or you know and the convincing power you know to tell our parents that see this is my dream and i would like to pursue that and obviously reasonable dreams so you we can't have like you know outrageous dreams and we say okay we'll not study or whatever but whatever your dreams are you should follow them and you will excel in whatever your passion is i have realized that we excel only in what our passion is wow and with that i thank you so much anjum for being here on the professor gv show and guys please do subscribe so that we can bring you more stories like anjum and from you know that being said 
uh, take care, do well, and let's keep it keep success through stories. Thank you so much for having me, Gaurav. It was such a pleasure being here. Yes. All right, guys. Take care. Bye bye.